Hey, Philippians 1.3 says, I thank my God every time I remember you. I find it so powerful that Paul, in everything that he could have written, chose to take a moment and say, I am thankful for you. I always love to start these refuels by actually giving you something that I think will encourage you. And you wanna know what I think might encourage you the most today? Is actually taking a moment to thank God for people. Who has God put in your life that you are just exceedingly grateful for? As I woke up this morning, I was thinking about names of people that have followed me throughout my life that I know have left their mark on me. And I took some time today to actually reach out to them and say, I am so thankful for you. You have made an impact on my life. And I try to be as specific as possible. God has been so good to put people in your life. God has been so good to put teachers, to put parents, to put perhaps coworkers, to put friends, to put even your kids. God has put some people in your life that are adding blessings into your life. We all know that life is full of the people that drain us, but I wonder if we spend enough time actually thanking God for the people He's put in our life that are filling to us. Take a moment today and take inventory of all of your relationships and take a moment to thank God for the encouraging, life-giving people that He's placed in your life. And then if you wanna do something extremely spiritual, take a moment and text them. Maybe write a handwritten card to them and actually thank them. I think this practice of actually acknowledging to God the blessing of people that He's given and taking time to thank them for the blessing, it will give your heart such encouragement and such joy. So as you start out your day, I hope you think of people you're grateful for, and I hope eventually that leads you to share that gratitude and to give you an encouraging day. I hope that encourages you.